Hello friends! Today I'm shooting this short for Machu, but this question I get quite often how to install and uninstall uh, new applications. So I use for instance this Z-Link application that I really love for CarPlay, but you should really try several versions to have the right resolutions for your screen. When I swapped to this laminated screen, I had to change my Z-Link version as well. Now, to swap versions, it is really easy. You first uninstall the application and therefore you go to the settings. When we go to more, you come in this Android menu, applications, and there you can see all the applications that you have. Now, for instance, let's say that I would delete this car launcher. You simply click on it and choose the uninstall, OK and it's gone and then to install a new application you should prepare a usb stick on the computer and download the application on it don't download the zip file but only put on the .apk file then you go to your file ma manager application you go to the usb stick itself and here you can see all the applications that you prepared on it so here I installed several Z-Link versions and I will put a link to a folder with those Z-Link versions in the video description. But here let's try to install the car launcher again. So therefore we select it, copy, then you go to the local folder right here, choose the APK folder and here you can paste it. There you go. Now it is installed locally on the device and now simply by clicking on it, you can install the new version. You can open it directly or just turn this off. And now let's check in the applications. The car launcher is right over there. So super easy to do yourself. You can delete and install applications as you like. If you don't have this unit yet, please check out my video description as well to see how to get this unit and get the best price. If you mention La Palmeray, then you even get your DAB Plus adapter and two factor cables for free. See you in the very next video. Bye bye.